Keep it going. Okay, so the battery was dead. That's bad preparedness on my part as a foreman or as a lead technician. We always need to be prepared. Have a backup battery. If your flashlight uses double A's, have backup double A's. In this case, we lucked out because they have electricity in the room that we can plug into. You can go ahead and charge it up. We also have one charged battery. And stay with me, Benix here. All right. Let's uh, plug that in. Let's keep on talking about our clutching. You can see here, that's the clutching effect. Now, if I took it all the way over here to the high speed, high torque, I can't, I can't hold that. It's going to burn my skin right off. So it does the same thing to that screw. So we're going to take one of the screws and you line these up. They're not going to line up on every single hole. But you want to get a fixed amount of screws in there. So we can't line it up on that one. So we'll go down here on this one. We just want to get them all started. Kind of zoomed in on that, so. Okay. You notice how I'm making sure that the screw's straight when it first threads in. That one screw at the beginning of the video, you saw it kind of went in a little crooked. You want to avoid that. Now you notice that one, two, three, four, five, and they're fairly evenly spaced. I'm going to come over to this side of the rack. I'm going to try and line them up in the same holes. 